Hello and welcome to the Furusia FEI Nations Cup final here in a very hot and sunny Barcelona. I'm joined by our commentator for the event, Steve Hadley. Hi Steve. Hi Sienna, you alright? Very well. What a stunning arena this is. It's a fabulous arena, you know. I mean, it's, it's not the biggest in the world, considering they had an Olympic Games here. I mean, I'm an old guy now, you know. I was here for the Olympics in 92. Uh, the I was one then. <laughs> yeah, OK. Point taken. Um, but it's, uh, it's uh, because of the nature of the arena, it's only, how big is it, 75 by 120. Um, it's going to be a fairly related distance course, you know, fences quite close together and he's got a lot of related distances here this afternoon. But I've just spoken to Santiago, the, the course designer, and I said, if I may put it in a one-liner, to me this is just a big, straightforward, full-blown Nations Cup course. He said, yeah, that's what it has to be. He said, we have the best in the world here. And it sure is big. Let's come and take a look at one of the fences. Okay. Now, Steve, is this fence going to be quite confusing to the horses? Because to me, it looks like they're asked to jump the fence and then go straight into the hospitality stand. It could well be, but horses, are, you know, with this experience will cope with that all right. But it's a good question, actually, because right behind, it's only four or five strides to the entrance to the ring, you know, the, the, the perimeter of the ring, rather. So it is a bit of an added hazard, yes. But let's have a look from the other side. You know, it's, uh, it's getting late on in the course now. It's straight after the water jump, and it is a tall vertical. You know, it's 160. Let's have a walk in there and just see how 160 measures up to your height. You're about 160, aren't you? Well, I think so. I like to think I am. Am I a little bit shorter than that? Is that on my tiptoes? Not really. About, no? That's about it. Five, oh, I'm quite five pleased with that. Three in English. It's always 160 to my nose, and I know I've got a big nose, but that's 160. <laughs> it's a big vertical, straight after the water. So we've established that it's a big course. Are there any really tricky lines that can catch people no, out? I don't think so. I think it's big and straightforward. You know, with modern horses, they can take a stride out or add a stride very easily at this level. You know, whatever this course designer throws at them, they can jump. But this is a big, big track. You know, it has to be. We've got the best in the world here. This is the final of the Fura CNA. It needs to be testing. It needs to be testing. It's the biggest one of the year. Why shouldn't it be, you know? Well, Steve, this is the last combination on course. How do you think this will ride? Not easy, you know, they'll be running out of puff a little bit by now, you know, because it's a triple bar, two short strides to a tall vertical, and then a big oxer coming out there, you know, and then followed by two more fences, a big oxer around the corner on five or six strides, and a very big vertical as to finish again right into the crowd. 160 again, it's a big, big course. Well, it's a fantastic course for the first competition of the Furusia FEI Nations Cup final. Can't wait. Me too.